20-year-old Tyson Dagley remains in police custody, charged with third-degree negligent homicide in connection with a deadly watercraft collision at Keihi Lagoon. According to court documents, 16-year-old Kristen Fonseca died last week Monday, one day after her watercraft was struck by another one driven by Dagley. The charges came quick in this case, and Dagley is likely the first person on Oahu charged since Hawaii's negligent homicide law was revised this session. Those changes in part were spurred by a deadly incident in Hawaii Kai three years ago. That's when 17-year-old Keahi Hoku Lum and a friend were run over by a boat while spearfishing off China walls. Lum died from massive lacerations. His family was frustrated as they waited over a year to find no criminal charges were filed against the boat operator. At that time, uh, when we look at the statute, negligent homicide only applied to vehicles, and a, a boat is not a ve vehicle, it's a vessel. Prosecutor Keith Kaneshiro said his office urged the Lum family to go to the legislature to change the law. This session, lawmakers did just that. What happened is the legislature saw that the law was not adequate enough, so they changed the law to include uh, a vessel because people can be negligent in operating a boat. Under Senate Bill 2971, the term vehicle was amended when it comes to negligent homicide to include not only motor vehicles, but also vessels and even mopeds, making it easier for prosecutors to bring charges. His girlfriend, Natasha Ryan, has been charged with hindering prosecution for allegedly lying about recording the incident on her camera.